I wish I could turn back the clock and be a college student today. Students today are more engaged, more confident, more vocal, and approach their futures with positive attitudes. Students in the 21st century are fun to teach. You have educational opportunities that I did not have. Education opens doors to successful and rewarding lives with numerous career choices. In some ways, the multitude of choices makes it more difficult to narrow your educational plan to a specific path. When you begin this math course, you are joining a team that makes your success its priority. I view this team composed of four parts. The student, the text, print or e-text, the technology, and the instructor. You must step up and take your share of the responsibility for your success in this course. Success is planned. Your success in this course will be a result of the effort and time you devote, not luck. Time to study will happen if you insert specific study times in your weekly schedule. Let me share a few of my favorite study tips. First, approach the class with a positive attitude. Set goals and expect success. Say to yourself, I can do this. I am up to the challenge. Be realistic about the amount of time you have available for this course. If you are working full time, and have family responsibilities, consider taking fewer hours. Know your textbook. Take a few minutes to read the preface. We wrote it for you. It explains how you can use all the features of the book to your advantage. One of the first things you should do is to learn how to access and use the technology that accompanies this text. Our technology component, My Math Lab, plays a vital role in your understanding and learning of the math skills needed to succeed in this course. Take advantage of it. Let the technology work for you. Let your book talk to you. For some students, it helps to read the exposition aloud. Stay ahead of the lectures by reading the section or sections that will be covered before attending class or watching videos. Each time I complete the manuscript for a chapter, I celebrate by treating myself to a hot fudge sundae after I place the package in a drop-off box. I will never forget the evening I mailed the exponential and logarithmic chapter. A young high school server came by my table, saw an algebra text and asked, do you teach math? I said I teach math by writing textbooks. Her response surprised me. She said, I did not know that real people did that. I have thought about that comment many times. I want you to see us, instructors and authors, as real people who care about you and your success in school. Instructors welcome emails and office visits. Take time to communicate with your instructor. In our textbooks and classes, we want you to gain a new appreciation for mathematics. Being in control of the math in your life will reward you with an increased quality of life. I am confident that if you invest an adequate amount of time in the learning process, this text will be of great value to you. The best thanks authors can earn from the experience of teaching you is for you to succeed in the next class and make progress along your career path. I wish you a positive learning experience.